What is up guys? Welcome back man. We're here today with a live reaction to Kaichi Ultimate Survivor Episode 10 man. Without further ado, let's jump right into this guys. Ixo! Also, if you hear any background noise, I just want to apologize about that ahead of time. So, bear with me. I'm just trying to get some content, some videos out there if you know what I mean. And this is just the best time to record. So last episode, going off of memory. Ah, uh, this dude Ando. Ando. Oh man, this dude has no respect for me. Like, I do not respect him at all. The type of person he is, he's very shady. What he did, how he switched up on us at the very end was very effed up and disrespectful, man. I really felt for my boy Kaiji. Now with... With, um, with, freak, I forgot his name, Fut Futahiro? I forgot how you pronounce it, hold up, this is gonna come to me. Going up. I feel it, good mentality, you know? Damn, that's the worst when you take it out the tr But then again, you can't just drag the trash. Of course it's gonna tear. That one's gonna tear too now. Oh, maybe not, okay. They still have to... Yeah, so we still have debt, pretty much. Damn, yo! Bro, let me hear what... Bro, that went up double. We'll make you pay. Look at how much debt were that. It was not worth it, bro. That was not worth it. We literally had less debt than that. You know what I'm trying to say, man. It's good to see we're just back into normal life, though. I didn't expect that. I thought we would be on the ship forever for so What was I thinking? Hmm. Yeah, but you did a good deed, you know what I'm trying to say? It's like, I feel like what this kind of shows you is those who do the good, they never really benefit, like, not that they don't benefit if you get what I'm saying. Bro, are you serious, bro? I'm cleaning the windows. Bro, get off his hair. Bro, yo, I quit this job. Oh my gosh, yo. Uh, 
Ah, this is yeah, he doesn't fit here. He was really pulling on Kaiji's hair. Like what? What type of boss does that? He lost something. I didn't even know there was an envelope there. I don't know. There was probably money. Bro, watch them blame this on Kaiji somehow. Bro, you can check. Yo, Kaiji. If you don't have it, let him check it. Just let him check it if you don't have it so you don't get yourself in trouble. If you don't have it, let him see. Like, what do you have in your bag that's so... Bro, what the heck? Who who makes this type of gamble with their boss? I don't know. I don't think he's going to accept it. He going to fire you, bro. Yo, Kaiji, you just made yourself so suspicious. If you don't have the money, you should have just checked. You, yeah. Nah, Kaiji, relax, bro. The th Kaiji, I get he's ups. He kind of handled that pretty poorly, I'm not going to lie. And plus, this is a job. You know, like, this is your job. That's your boss, man. You have to have, even if you don't like it, you got to bite your teeth. Wait, bite your teeth? What am I saying? Hold, bite your, bite your tongue, yeah. I feel like he, the best thing to lessen everything would have been just to let him check. Because you obviously didn't take it. You don't have it. It would have cleared out your name and everything, you know? Think, bro. He quit on the spot. Think, bro. Yeah. Damn. I mean, it's the truth. Stop capping, bro. You quit. What? I mean... Damn, 
he hit it on him? Damn, look at that! What the heck? I mean, I, I'm not even mad at it, bro. I'm not even mad at it. Like, what? That's dirty money, too? Bro, let's go to... What is this? A bar? Oh, a bar? Okay. That was pretty quick and fast thinking on him. Every time people come in, he gets, like, you know... Anxious. Hmm. Yeah, that's the thing with money, like, you do, you can do, it's kind of interesting because you can hit a jackpot and be successful, but that's like really lucky, you know, but it's hard to, you know, get it, but you can get lucky, of course, but. This guy's very perceptive. I was not expecting this from his character. You're not gonna thank him for the drinks? Oh, oh yeah, I thought he was leaving, okay. I mean, I can't blame you. Bro, this better not be the tab or... Bro, why do I feel like this dude's setting him up now? Cause now all of a sudden he has like the num- I don't know. Look bro, and he's going to the toilet right when Kaiji's gonna call? That is sus. Like he- it's like a fake or something, I don't know. I knew it! Bro! Bro, Kaiji just- I mean, I-, I <laughs> He doesn't want to let this part of his life know, and I don't blame him. Ah! <laughs> oh, bro, it's another one of those. Bro, oh my god. <laughs> one night, eliminate all your debt. Damn, the homies here with us. Twenty million. Damn, he wants to get in the mix. But he's smart. I think he can kind of do his thing. 
Yeah, it's very risky, actually. We gotta take risk. Damn! Sahara, yo! Damn. Damn. There is, like, it's like. Six point sixty eight, okay. Damn you just finished smoking, bro, and though like you gonna light another one? Damn. But that'll take a lifetime. Yeah, especially not with a good job. Like, you don't have a good job. How, how much? I know it was going to be... How, how much is that? I don't know. 16 years. Nah, that's not the way to live, bro. 40? Oh my gosh, bro. That's crazy. Damn, people really be paying debt for the rest of their lives, you know? Yo, Sahara seen the money, he don't know how to act. Oh, man. Damn. I mean, we, we're going to do it. I know we're going to do it. Definitely. Sahara, like, I'm definitely doing it. He don't care. He's like, I'm trying to make some money. Uh, this soundtrack, I like it. Yo, this soundtrack is fire! What the heck?
Ah! <laughs> this is hype! 13th of July, 9 p.m. You were in July! We just started July, yo! Come to think. Oh, come to where the stars are. Is that like a riddle? Like a little, um. Come to where the stars are. Look at this building. Man. Are we gonna see Sahara? Is he with us? I must, is his name Sahara or Sahara? How did he. Starside Hotel. I think that's him. Oh, no, never mind. Yo, a lot of you guys have been telling me this next arc we're going into? Hype! 10 out of 10! Godly! Greatness! I'm hyped! Let's go! This is a good startup to get you into it. Damn! This is such a good... I'm gonna keep this as a single. Because I feel like this is such a good episode just to get the hype and get you riled up for the episode if you know what I'm trying to say. You know what I mean? This was quite interesting because it's like... When you think about it, people in this world really live and die paying debt. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they live off debt. Like, their whole lives just paying off debt. And it sucks. It's sad, man, when you think about it. You know what I mean? But then again, on the flip side, I think a lot of, you know, money made is through debts. Like, that's how the, you know, how civilization and everything is run and is sustaining through the debts. It's kind of crazy when you think of it. Because I was watching um this show, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Mr. Robot, to where there were, damn, I don't want to spoil actually, never mind, I won't, I won't compare it to Mr. Robot. But yeah, a lot of civilization runs on debts and whatnot. And it's sad when you see that even if Kaiji were to get a proper job and to work, he would still be paying debt till he was like 40. It's kind of sad when you think about it like that. Like you're like, damn, till his 40s, his whole life just doing that just with a proper job. Man, when you, that shit is sad, bro. Like, man, I just want him to do good and prosper. He's such a good person. It's like, you want good to come his way. He does the right thing. He does the good deeds. Yet it's, he's always, you know, like, he's always given a bad hand in life. He tries to go work a proper job. They accuse him for freaking stealing the money. You know what I'm trying to say? Even though, like I said, I do kind of blame him there. But then again, actually, no, I don't. Like, look, I was I was going to say I blame him. Like, if he had just shown his bag, things would have probably been okay. But then again, obviously, it wouldn't have been okay because he freaking did have the money because Sahara put the money in his bag. So he would have got, you know, in trouble regardless. But, yeah, like... I just feel like even, let's just say a hypothetical, if he didn't have the money, I feel like the best bet, the best move would have been to just show the bag and be like, see, look, I don't have it. You know what I'm trying to say? Rather than fighting it. But then again, he did feel disrespected because the guy, he was on him, like the manager was on him the whole day, calling him a delinquent, telling him to cut his hair, calling him a fool, saying he wasn't working, then he wants to pin him for stealing the money. It's like, you know what I'm trying to say? And then the guy himself isn't a good person. The money he had, the hundred, like the hundred thousand yen is like crooked money stuff that you know the workers were owed that they didn't receive so when you look at it like that you really can't respect it yo i just can't wait to see what's in store for kaiji like i can't wait to see these next events and you know what we have to do to keep going and to get this debt out of here but the thing with this as you can see high risk high reward like i mentioned because we did this firstly with the you know um with the ship s as poor as pure with the ship when we went on the ship for the you know to clear our debt but when we did this we accumulated another you know debt we like basically half our debt so we got three million more yen onto our three million yen before giving us a total of six million you know what i'm trying to say so the thing is if we go here and we flop again this could be worse. We might even get half of that 6 million more yen onto our previous debt, adding more and more to our debt to a point where we'll never be able to pay it off. You know what I'm trying to say? It's going to be getting crazy. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it to the end, you're amazing, yo. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Peace! Yo.
Hop out the back, no Bessie, uh I take the wheel, no taxi, yeah uh. I move too fast, can't catch me, yeah uh. She move too fast, she nasty, what? Only these niggas to be the drag queens, bad things